98.7 WFGR. It is 821. Robert Palmer, Addicted to Love, Andy O, and Dave Cackley. And I'm going to tell you what, my friend, I have just solved every one of your economic problems. Go ahead. In one, Enlighten me. In, in one swoop. Okay. All you got to do is sell your car. Sell my car. Sell your car, and, and th- your problems will be over. Why do you say well, that? Well, we talked last week about uh-huh. how much you're overpaying for insurance. Uh, and it turns out I'm not. You're not? I'm not overpaying, no. Okay, you sure? Um, almost positive. Do you yeah. still have a loan on that car? No, I've, it's been paid off for uh, ever. Okay, well, good. All right, good. But over the weekend, in fact, it was late last week, mm-hmm. didn't they sell the original Batmobile for like $4 million? Uh, was it $4 million? Four and a half, I think. And that was the original. That's the that original was Batmobile. The, the original one that uh, Adam West the, drove. Follow me along here. There's a trend, though. Okay. Okay. The Batmobile goes for $4.5 million. Uh-huh. Former President George W. Bush mm-hmm. just sold his old pickup truck at auction. three hundred grand. That was it? $300,000. For, for a former president. For a pickup truck, he drove around his property. Yeah. But he was a former president compared to a fictional superhero. Right, right, right. But three hundred thousand dollars for a pickup truck. Well, if the Batmobile's fetching four million, I would have thought that would have at least garnered a million. Well, I'm just telling you right now for a what is it a ninety one? Um, for what I no, I have a two thousand one. Oh, two thousand. Well, it looks like a ninety one. Whatever. Anyway, you could at least get five hundred bucks for that. <laughs> Maybe a grand. Dude, I get a couple of grand for that. Put it up for sale. Uh, no, I don't want I, I put I'm it up attached. for sale and see if you can you get two grand for it. You know how I am. I don't like change at all. Right. Even if it's something that's uncomfortable for me to drive. I got the crack in the windshield. The heaters kind of works most of the time. Um, you know, I've got the dents and dings in it. I've got three hubcaps, but I'm, I don't like, I'm comfortable with it right now. You're comfortable with it right now. Until it dies and I'll get another car and I'll be comfortable with that. But I can't, I can't in good conscience, um, uh, stop driving something that still runs. I'll tell you what, here's what we're going to do. Let's open the phone lines for bidding. (laughs) If you would like a 2001 Sunfire and you think that you can, you know, help Dave out of his little Uh situation here, what are you going to start the bidding at? Two grand? (sighs) How many miles on it? There are 190,000 miles. Oh, is that all? Yeah, 100, <laughs> 191,000. When's the last time you had the tires put on? Uh, new t- I had, uh, well, I had to get a new tire put on. Uh, uh, no, it was no, actually no, no, used no, no, tire. No. I said, oh, used tire? <laughs> well, yeah. Nice. Discount. <laughs> what? Discount doesn't sell used tires. Well, yeah, you get no. Yeah, you uh, you can get a used tire. Yeah, they do. Discount Tire Company sells used tires. Okay. All right. So you you, you bought put a 50 tire. 50 bucks into that, yeah. <laughs> Oh, 50, 50 bucks. Oh, that's fifty dollars. I, I probably have changed three of the four tires. Okay. At some point. At, 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 at Over the past few years. Okay. And since like oh nine, I think. Well, okay. Three years. <laughs> what? It's, I bought my last used tire in two thousand nine. <laughs> no, my last used tire was actually uh uh mid two thousand ten. What kind of what kind summer. of mileage does this thing get? It probably gets I'd say twenty between twenty five and thirty miles. Is that young. right? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's a. It's what do you want compact. to start the bid at? I think you would start it. We'd probably start it at 800. 800? Yeah. We'll if the if... bidding gets high enough, we open the phones up. The bidding gets high enough here. <laughs> but but, but will you take so... it? Uh, if it gets up high, high enough, but I don't know that these will be legitimate bids. Somebody calls, I think people so, are just somebody playing calls in and says, my leg. I want to give you 2500 bucks for your car. Are you going to sell it? Yes. Really? Yes. $2,500. 2500 bucks. Uh, and I am I am a I am what you would call what a an F-level celebrity. <laughs> <laughs> would you leave that in the condition it is, or would you clean it out for the nice people? Uh, well, you know what? I think you would want my stuff in it. I it's think, kind of like I think a museum piece. Yeah, exactly. It's a museum to me. Yeah. To my uh, to my lifestyle. So it comes with all kinds it of Fritos wrappers, and you get. There's actually, I know this for a fact. There is. There are two pepperonis that I had to pull off of a a Speedway pizza. That I got because yeah. I'm I don't eat red meat and there are only like three pepperonis on it. There was some sausage yeah, the on it. Pepperonis so just, made out of pork. Yeah, no, I, no pepperonis made. Out, I don't know what it's. No, made it's out sausage. Of. It's pork sausage. It is really. Uh huh. Because I asked a woman when I was buying frozen. I tried to buy a frozen pizza the other day. Really, I can eat pepperoni and that doesn't violate my red meat. It's pork sausage. Hmm. Huh. I got to double. I should double check. Okay. All right. Um, that'll be my Facebook question. So you got a couple of pepperonis so, on the yeah, floor. Yeah, so the, yeah, that we're still in the little um, box that the thing comes in. So I left <laughs> that. That's in the back seat. And yeah, assorted shoes. There is. Yeah, there are. There is a pair of shoes uh, in the back seat, and there might. There's also a a snuggie 
Ooh. back there too. Yeah, it's in case you end up in the, the ditch. Yeah, in case, yeah, in case you need to, you know, Got all start the a little fire in there. Yeah, comes there's enough. The ca- there's enough wrappers in there. You can start a fire inside that car. Comes with a car seat. Well, no. Yeah, no, you said no. you were leaving it as is. Yeah, no, no. Well, I don't have the car seat in it right now. Oh, you I don't go get the car seat. Yes. All right. Um, so no, it doesn't come with a car seat. Well, if you're 16 and living in a single wide, here's your opportunity <laughs> to bid. 616-459-9889. We, this thing, you know what? You know what they call this thing? This is cherry. No, they call this a cream puff. What do you, what do you mean by that? That's the kind of caliber of vehicle we're uh, talking about, a cream puff. All right. 14 degrees. What's happening in the traffic? Well, uh, looking pretty good, at least on most of your major roadways. Uh, earl, earlier accidents uh, have been uh, cleared out of your way, but we still have a few fender benders out there and some slide-offs. Lydia at Benson, that uh, area is pretty icy. Also, Michigan at Monroe, two-car crash there. 76th at Kalamazoo, 84th at Woodruff, another accident. You still want to take it easy as you make that morning drive. Give yourself about 15 to 20 extra minutes to make that morning commute. Uh, that is traffic on 98.7 WFGR. All right, the phones are open. Open for any and all bids on Dave's 1999 <laughs> it's Sunfire. It's a 2001. Whatever it is. Hey, 